guys, so today I'm going to be doing a video on food and restaurant recommendations in Iceland from an Icelander and these are all specifically right here in Reykjavik. So if you are planning a trip to Iceland, then definitely keep on watching. Before I start, I do want to mention that this is a collaboration with all of the restaurants. However, I would not be recommending them if I did not absolutely love them all. And to be honest, these are honestly the most popular and trendy places here in Iceland, especially for the locals. I will have all of the names of the food and drinks that I eat and drink at the description box if you want to order the same food that I was eating. The first restaurant that I went to is called Apotek. I went there with my friend Same, who you have all seen on my channel before. It's my favorite like high-end classy restaurant here in Iceland. Apotek actually won two awards at the Bartender's Choice uh, back in 2019. They won the People's Choice Award and Dilakin, the green cocktail that I will show in the video, actually won the best signature cocktail. So mm, definitely have to give that one a try. We are at Apotek and we are going to taste Hekla. Scout. It's like candy. This is like one of my favorite cocktails in Iceland. So these are the appetizers or starters. I have tasted this so many times before. This is one of my favorites. This yes. looks so good. Uh, and the fish is so fresh. I'm gonna start with the fish. Mm, yes, so excited. Okay. Okay, no. Mm -hmm. So soft. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, so good. Let's go with this one. So good. I like this place. Next up is the Carpaccio. Mm. My favorite. Oh, what do you mean? We of course have the Icelandic lamb. This is not like traditional Icelandic food that I hate. <laughs> it definitely is Icelandic and traditional, but it's like the cool type. Yeah, yeah, exactly. It's the cool. trendy and cool Icelandic mm -hmm. food. Next cocktail. <laughs> <laughs> Next cocktail yes. uh, is Dillagin. It's green. It's This is the salmon, this is the lamb, and this is... The other face. <laughs> the other face that I can't remember the name of. Lanka. Yes. <laughs> I'm gonna start with the salmon. Mm. So soft, I need more. The lanka is... Okay. Yeah. I don't I mean... hate it, I usually hate it. I love lamb, so I know yeah, me too. It's gonna be good. So good. What's this? It's your carrot. Nah. <laughs> oh my god, I thought it was a hot dog. <laughs> hot dog in there. Yeah, like, why is there a hot dog there? Traditional Icelandic food. This is eye puppy. Peek you out. <laughs> <laughs> cake. My god. We also have like ice cream with each dessert. And it's so pretty. Yes. Everything gets cut up. We recommend this place. Go go get it is the name of this one. This was excellent. Next, I am going to be recommending Fjallkonan. I went there with my mom. Fjallkonan is a little bit more funky and fun and oh my god, their desserts are just the best. Here we have uh, one of our uh, most popular cocktails called uh, Candy Gloss Boss. And here we have a uh, virgin cocktail, non-alcoholic. Okay. I just got this Candy Gloss cocktail. Okay. Ooh. Wow! <laughs> like very known for crazy cocktails like this. So we just got um, Iceland on our table. This is the outline of Iceland. I'm starting out with this one. Mm. It's 
very different. I like it. Next we have this. This is blueberry. Mm. I am going to taste this one first. Huma. Huma. Lobster. I love lobster. Mm. I like that a lot. Good. I eat it. Next I'm tasting this one. I don't even know what to recommend because everything is so good. So I'll just get it all. I bought. Did you make it? No. Oh! <laughs> uh, next we have uh, Karma Camillo in here. Okay. So the concept is you mix it together and uh, when it's mixed with citric acid it changes color. And here we have uh, Bio Paradis. It's a uh, popcorn, cola, pineapple and spiced cocktail. My mom is the biggest popcorn fan that I know of. I bet she's really happy with her popcorn. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> Ooh. Oh yeah. popcorn cocktail. I've seen this cocktail so many times on social media. Mm. It's like pineapple yeah. and then you can like smell the popcorn as you're <laughs> drinking it. <laughs> Here we have a beer cocktail. Uh, it's Ooh. called I'll Have a Beer. Here we have a grapefruit, a bunch of fruits also. Okay, open. Okay. Yes. Oh Ooh. <laughs> I usually don't like beer. So, mm -hmm. it's a beer cocktail. I'm very excited. Mm. I'm starting out with a fish and then this. Not the biggest fan of fish, but you like it. I love it. She loves it, so you get very good. <laughs> so you have the fish approval code from my mom. But I am excited for the lamb. I love lamb. Okay, let's taste it. Mm. So good. Okay, we have a table full of pineapple masters. And another cocktail, of course. This is just a simple uh, twist of the classic espresso routine. I love this. It's our favorite. I'm going to start with the caramel pancake. Two others, one Four different types of pancakes. This is like a traditional Icelandic pancake and a ski. I don't even know which one to recommend because these are all so 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 good we had a very very nice bartender his name is Saivat he actually has a very cool Instagram if you want to go follow him if you're interested in like cocktails and stuff like that next I want to recommend my personal absolute favorite restaurant in Iceland Susi Social Susi Social is obviously known for their sushi but they also have so many amazing food if you don't like sushi I went there with my friend Altis and I'm going to have to do a voiceover because it was so packed. Like Sushi Social is probably the most popular restaurant in Iceland. So I got my favorite cocktail, porn star mojito, and this amazing cocktail that was so good. And I spilled all over myself. Here is Altis, my friend. She also loved the cocktails. And we of course had to take a shot of Brennivin, which <laughs> was not very nice. This was an appetizer. This is lunte or a puffin and uh, like potatoes with amazing like truffle ch cheese on top. Uh, then we had some more sushi on an Icelandic plate. Oh my god, this was so so good. And uh, there was also a bleikja there and I dropped the sushi in the soy sauce because <laughs> I am just I'm just not good with sushi, um, but I, I had a good time. It was this delicious, so that's all that matters, right? Um, then we had some more cocktails. This one was so good, probably one of my favorites in Iceland. And then, oh my god, my favorite food in the entire universe. We had the surf and turf and volcano. This was the surf and turf. Oh my god. And this is volcano. So, 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 so good. Um, yeah, basically my favorite food in the entire universe. Then we have the salmon. 
which was so good oh my god it was so fresh and soft just delicious um, more cocktails because why not these were also so delicious i just i love the cocktails at sushi social they're so good then we had some lamp which like <laughs> it was delicious like everything else was um yeah mm, oh my god and the dessert we also had an um, espresso martini with this dessert this was like a skir cheese no skir i can't remember the name but i'll have to put it like somewhere on the screen Susie social just has my entire heart i there's just nothing that i love more than Susie social honestly next i want to recommend tapas Baden, which is a little bit more chill and down to earth than the other places tapas Baden is actually one of the oldest restaurants here in iceland and i went there with my friend olaf let's go let's go Okay, so this is a passion fruit sangria. Definitely recommend to order a sangria because you get a big can of it and get you very drunk on an empty stomach. <laughs> oh, fancy. Mmm, smoked Icelandic glass. Also looks very nice on a stone. <laughs> Next, we have smoked puffin. Not, 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 not for her. I am a meat lover. <laughs> so I really did this. This is Icelandic brennivin, also called snaps. This is not good, no. <laughs> but a must in Iceland. If you want to feel like a Viking, you have to take a shot of Icelandic brennivin. Yeah. Mm. Lobster! Crunchy and soft. Next up is Lanka. Oh no! Very nice! Okay, more Icelandic land! And my second favorite, speed! Tuna. It's okay, but from a tuna fan. Okay, if you're a tuna fan, then it's a yes. Ooh, chicken, chicken strips. Chocolate cake, chocolate mouse, creme brulee, skier, Icelandic skier mouse. Oh my goodness! <laughs> Just look at it. Crazy good. And last but not least, we have Saita Svinit, which is so funky and fun. I just, I love Saita Svinit. I went there with my friend Magnea and we had a blast. We have the Icelandic Brennivin. Snaps. Yep. Snaps. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. Magna is going for the beer tour. Mm, this middle one. But you medium. can decide on light, medium, and dark. I don't drink beer, so I am getting a Rappa Bara cocktail. Mm. cocktail. Very Icelandic. Very Icelandic. Mm. Ah, to get this, this is like a caramel popcorn with pecan nuts. Here is a Rappa eating a Rappa. Let's go, let's go. Oh god. Ooh, and the Rappa Bara oh. cocktail. It's very, very sexy. <laughs> okay, uh, puffin? <laughs> it's so good. Yeah. <laughs> it's so good. It's so good. It's so good. Mm, I'm gonna start with Viking Rock. Mm? Mm, you should drink beer. I'll give it a taste. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Don't like this beer. Is beer. <laughs> I know. This is Kalte Dökku. Yes. Mm. Mm. It's good. It's okay. not what I expected. Ooh. It is officially a medium beer, but it's really dark. Mm. <laughs> yeah. No. no. That's good I'm here then, because I yes. like beer. <laughs> yes, good. The next one is Arctic Pale Ale. 
Mm. Mm. It's kind of this different taste. Ooh, flavors of citrus, malt, caramel, and hoppy finish. Mm -hmm. And a hoppy finish. This one's a little bit better. Yeah, because it has like a little bit of sweetness. This one I have never tried. It's Ponte Session IPA. <gasps> this one is good. Okay. Mm. It's nice. It's nice. Uh, here we have. Uh, this was flat camca my plate. And this was. Carpaccio. And it was Rosa Carpaccio. Yeah, Rosa Carpaccio. I can start with the Carpaccio. Yes. <laughs> Not a big fan of fish, mm -hmm. but I promised I would try it. Yes. This is really nice. Yes. I told ya. I think I'm gonna eat it all. <laughs> uh, we have uh, Malanga and Icelandic lamb. Mm. We are going to start with the fish. Mm. Lamb is my favorite. Ooh, cheers. Judy. Mm. Mm. <laughs> mm. <laughs> These fries oh, mm. are amazing. Yes. Waffle mm. fries. Mm. <laughs> mm. 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 Skid dessert. Mm. Mm. <laughs> So those are all of the restaurants that I am recommending. Thank you so much to all of these restaurants for collaborating with me. I could not be more grateful and happy. I do have a highlight on my Instagram called Food in Iceland. So if you are uh, on a trip here and just need fast recommendation, then you can just go click through that. Once again, thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys soon. Okay, bye.